Good morning and welcome to PLZ Soccer. This is your Scottish News Bulletin on Thursday. Rangers, Hearts, Partick Thistle and Stranraer are the first clubs to oppose the SPFL's proposed resolution to terminate the seasons in the Championship, League One and League Two, promoting and relegating teams on a points-per-game basis. Dundee United, Wraith Rovers and Cove Rangers would all go up, with Partick Thistle and Stranraer relegated. The SPFL claimed that government advice meant fulfilling the fixtures would affect next season's start date, something they're not willing to do. The advice for the Premiership is to remain postponed, giving it the best possible opportunity to complete the campaign and they'll comply with UEFA, waiting until their meeting on Friday the 23rd of the month. However, if that does not happen, the same system would be used, crowning Celtic and relegating Hearts. All playoffs would also be cancelled, meaning the pyramid playoff involving the Highland and Lowland League would not be uh, happening. But if the resolution is approved, league reconstruction will be looked at. The SPFL have promised that. Uh, Rangers stated that they will oppose uh, anything in the strongest possible terms to end the season. And they propose a member's resolution to release prize money now to help clubs struggling for revenue. The Ibrox Club believe that any rule changes should not be railroaded and rushed through and that relegating clubs by a vote before the 38 games are completed would be abhorrent. Hearts, who of course stand to go down if the top flight gets called, have revealed their position, uh, owner Anne Budge claiming it's time for pragmatism, not rules. They'll back Rangers members' resolution to release the money and believe that the prize fund and the league finishing do not need to be linked. These are the thoughts of Partick Pistol as well who have said they will not accept being relegated to League One. They believe more discussion, scrutiny and debate are required before any vote can be taken and are engaging with others to amend the proposal. For the legislation to pass, nine Premiership clubs, eight in the Championship and 15 in Leagues One and Two must vote for it. With the ballot deadline Friday at 5pm, the results are expected early next week. That's all from me this morning. Thanks for watching. Stay tuned for more updates throughout the day as they come. And don't forget, the football show with Pete and Ruffy is on at the new time of 4 o'clock on Facebook and YouTube.